I gave, I asked for my report and it when I discovered that my cholesterol was 270. And I said, that's too high. And um, she gave me the results of the cholesterol. And she said that it was not, uh, I don't have to worry about it, about my cholesterol because it was two points up and uh, it was nothing to worry about it. And because I walk, so it's going to be okay. And uh, then I started looking for another option. It, it took a while for me to change, but I was patiently waiting and walking and doing all the best I could with my diet and and taking the medicine that she that, that this other doctor was giving me. And but I was very very uh, how can I say worried because my blood pressure was still very changing very. Uh, a lot. I got the first doctor I saw, it was uh, Dr. Taylor. And um, she, he was very patient. She, she, he sent me with, uh, with the cardiologist. He said, well, it's going to be the best way. He's going to, he's going to be, uh, he's going to help you uh, with your blood pressure, he's probably going to do some exams and 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 see and you inform me how how it goes. So everything starts getting in place, and he said, "Okay, uh, we're going to. I want to give you some some uh, uh, recommendations for you to eat and see how it goes. You just let me know. We're going to do an appointment and probably in two months." And um, and so on and and I was progressing because I had faith and I was confident with uh, him and so everything come, came in place little by little and I start feeling better eating. He recommend me uh, the Swiss chart, yes a cup, and I was doing my juices, green juices with all the vegetables and leaves and also the seeds. He was recommending me um, uh, seeds like uh, almonds, walnuts, and and uh, uh, sunflower seeds and chia and uh, flax seeds. So I was just using, I said, oh, okay, if this is good, so I just going to just going to do a variety of all these seeds. I'm going to eat one day this and one day that. Uh, I would like to see a nutritionist. I don't know if you can recommend me one. And uh, and yes, he did. He did recommend me one. And I said, but it needs to be good because I, I know some. <laughs> I know, I know, I've been searching and I, and I know it, it needs to be good. So, yes, he said, I will recommend you a good one. So, yes, uh, I had an appointment with her and she was very good. So, I was seeing her and um, uh, I think it was four sections. And the first section, she said, okay, you will not eat any, any grease. For nothing, you will not use uh, oils. So, yes, I, I, I will not use oils. So, I start the first week and then the second appointment, she was just uh, asking me how it go. And I said, so far, so good. And she said, okay, now no meats. And I said, okay, no meats. Okay. Uh, and I started, I started just cutting and cutting meats. And I went with the doctor and, say, and he said, yes, no meats. And I said, okay, okay, I can do it. Blood pressure started being very good, very, very good. And I stopped taking one pill because I was taking two pills and so I start taking I start taking only one and night in the morning I don't
Cholesterol is is been is been very good because the last one, the last time, which it was in January, we had an appointment. Um, the doctor and I, and he said, "Ooh, your uh um uh, uh the heart doctor I'm going to be very happy with you." He said because your you your cholesterol is being good and all the things that has to be with the heart are very good right now. I've been hiking since then. Uh, this time today, this week, it was like a six, uh, like a seven miles, oh. seven miles every day for for three days. And today, yesterday and today, I only did three, I only three and a half, just because I want to rest my body. It's because I have my goal. 300 loops at the mountain, Ruby Doo. Three, 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 at least three and a half miles every day. God gave me another opportunity to live. 